thank you very much uh, in fact uh, one of the prominent persons uh, who wished you know this today's symposium which we believe in fact you know contributed to our uh, world of science and knowledge uh, to take place was professor Gunai, then who passed away you know suddenly on may uh, 15 uh, 2023 and it will be impossible for us to finalize this meaningful conference you know without remembering him because of his contributions and efforts not only to this meeting but also to us as his students and colleagues and to turkish semiotics and the world of science then therefore uh, i would like to talk briefly about Professor Günay, my dear professor, colleague and friend, on behalf of my colleagues and friends serving the development of semiotics, both in my country and worldwide. Then, in fact, when we say uh, Doğan Günay, we are not only talking about a distinguished academic, we are also talking about a you know, good human being. Hence, to understand Professor Günay, it's necessary to consider him within the framework of these two basic characteristics. And Professor Günay, in fact, is an important Turkish scholar who has achieved many success throughout his academic career. And in addition uh, to, edu to educating many researchers, he made significant contributions to science in the fields of language, literature, linguistics, and semiotics. Then Professor Günay was a highly productive person, in fact, throughout his academic life of more than uh, 40 years. Then his endless love of science and motivation deeply influenced the people around him. Then with these characteristics, Professor Günay served science by involving many people behind him with the same motivation in many studies. Then, the most important concern of Doğan Günay, who worked and produced non-stop, even in his retirement, that I can say, you know, was to make semiotic studies in Turkey more qualified and wider spread. Then, for this objective, he has made significant efforts to spread semiotic studies in Turkey and to ensure that these studies, in fact, take their rightful place, uh, you know, on the world scale. Then, while realize, uh, reali realizing, in fact, all these dreams, Doğan Günay never neglected young minds since the beginning. Then wherever he went he was always surrounded by young people or young researchers let's say you know and their love then seeing the future of semiotics in our country and the world in young people and young scholars professor Günay has offered them you know important opportunities in everything he has done in turkey then the most concrete example of this can be seen in Turkish Semiotic Society and its members, of course. Then today, uh, these young friends are the most important inheritance of our Professor Günay. Then, known by almost everyone for this benevolence and the importance he attached to young minds, Professor Günay always loved people and valued their thoughts. Then, among Gunai's most important characteristics was his unifying power. Then wherever, you know, whenever he desired to produce something, for instance, let's say a project, he suddenly incorporated in such scientific facilities many of our young friends and colleagues. Then uh, he never discriminated between them then he wanted everyone to develop and contribute to science. Then he never tried of 
tired of helping and encouraging the people around him and unconditionally supported their improvement. And so, some of us, in fact, here, were those, you know, young, many years ago, to whom Professor Gunai contributed a lot. Then we respectfully commemorate our Professor Doan Gunai, who was always with us unconditionally and contributed, a, let's say, great deal of, great deal to our progress. Then we wish him eternal mercy for, from Almighty God. Uh, thank you very much, Hilal. Uh, but before concluding, I would like to thank to all my Korean and Turkish colleagues, friends, and participants who contributed to, you know, organizing the symposium. Then I would also like to thank, you know, Professor Yan Hilly for her professional, timely and friend, friendly support in every aspect of symposium throughout the process. Then hope to see you again at another event. Thank you very much.